Today, we're tackling a topic that hits close to home, the RSV virus. So let's chat about keeping our kids healthy. What's RSV? RSV, or respiratory syncytial virus, is like a cold, sneaky cousin. It can bring on coughing, sneezing, a runny nose, and even a fever. But here's the twist. It can be a bit tougher, especially for our tiny babies. So how does it spread? RSV loves company, so it jumps from person to person through tiny droplets when someone with RSV coughs or sneezes. Plus, it can hang out on surfaces, so keeping things squeaky clean is a smart move. Who's at risk? Our littlest ones, especially those under one, are more prone to getting hit hard by RSV. Premature babies and kids with health issues need extra protection and care. What are the symptoms? Symptoms may start like a regular cold, but watch out for signs like difficulty breathing, wheezing and fast breathing. That's the red flag. Time to act. It may also bring on a fever and lead to respiratory challenges. Parents should pay attention to changes in their child's cough and be vigilant for signs of dehydration. If breathing issues or persistent symptoms arise, seeking medical help promptly is crucial for early intervention and care. The mortality rate for RSV varies widely based on factors such as age, overall health and access to medical care. Generally, the majority of RSV cases resolve on their own with supportive care and fatalities are more likely to occur in specific high-risk groups. What can we do? Hand hygiene. Wash those hands regularly, especially around the little ones. Avoid crowded places when sick. If you or your child is under the weather, maybe postpone that play date. Seek medical help. If your little one shows signs of severe illness, don't hesitate to see a doctor. It's better to be safe. Thanks for spending time with me today. If you found this helpful, share it with other parents or anyone who might need this info.